This local sports report is presented by Clark Construction Management, a proud supporter of the Junior A Orangeville Northmen. Learn more about Clark Construction by visiting their website at clarkconstructionmgt.com. Let's head back to the Bunny Barn for Junior A Lacrosse, the Orangeville Northmen back at the Tony Rose on Tuesday night. The Northmen, 14-0 this season, looking to keep the streak alive and shoot for a perfect regular season. They would host the Six Nations Arrows. Jumping to the first and it wouldn't take long before the Northmen would strike. Watch the cut from Colton Marquis. He draws the defense and Colton sets up Joey Spelina and Joey's got a rocket, so it's 1-0. And the Northman wouldn't stop there. Moments later, and watch the laser from Amos Whitcomb. He rips it off the post and in, and it's 2 nothing Northman. A couple minutes later, now the Northman on the power play, and it's more from Amos Whitcomb. Amos is in the middle, and his quick release shot is money! So it's 3 for Orangeville. The Northman rolling, and they keep the pressure up. Watch the play from Trey Deer. He cuts across and sends it to Cohen Jennings, and Cohen dunks it home! So it's 4 nothing Northman. The arrow's back with the ball now, looking to get something started, but watch the lockdown defense from the Northmen. Trey Deer comes out with the ball, and he sends it deep for Colton Marquis, and Marquis's got a pair! And it's 5-0 Northmen. The Northmen keep the foot on the gas, and later in the first, how about Liam Matthews? He likes his look, and Liam sends it home! So it's 6 for the Northmen. Six Nations back with the ball now, looking to end the Northmen's roll. Tyler Davis is stopped by Chris Origlieri, but watch for the rebound. Mitchell Van Every dunks it in! So the arrows are on the board. Late in the first period, now the Northman back with a man advantage, moving the ball around. It's a couple quick passes from Jamison Bucktooth, and Liam Matthews steps inside, and Matthews buries his second. So it's 7-1 Northman, heading to the second. In the second period, now the arrows looking to counterattack, but look out for Colton Marquis. He picks off the pass and sends it to Trey Deer, and Trey's on the board. So it's 8-1 Northman. The arrows back on the attack now, and watch the pass from Reef Beal. He sets up Tyler Davis down low, and Tyler finishes it. So the arrows are at two. The Northmen back to their way now, looking to keep pace, and it's a good setup for Caleb Benedict. He fires from out high, and Caleb finds the goal match. So it's 9-2. The arrows attacking once again, but watch this play from the Northmen's netminder, Chris Origlieri. He makes the stop, and Chris launches a pass over the pack. Colton Marquis is wide open on the breakaway, and Colton's got a hat trick. That's a great pass from Origlieri, and the Northmen are at 10. Only three seconds later now, and it's more Northman offense. Joey Spelina spots out Trey Deer out front, and Trey's got his second of the night, so it's 11-2. The arrow's finding some footing in the second, and it's more from Tyler Davis. He finds an inside pass for Thunder Hill, and Thunder brings the lightning, so it's 11-3. Minutes later, now the Northman killing. This is Liam Matthews with the ball. Matthews wants a reset, so he fires from the wall, and Liam Matthews, that's a snipe! It's a hat trick for Matthews, and it's 12-3 Northman. The Northmen in full control of this one, but here comes some fireworks. It's Cameron Pack and Dalen John Hill tangled up behind the Northmen net, and the two would tango. Both players receiving five minute majors and a game misconduct as things heat up in Orangeville. That exchange would send the Northmen to the power play, and on that power play, it's Trey Deer converting again. That's his third of the night, and the Northmen are at 13. And before the period was over, Trey would find his fourth. Colton Marquis sets up Deer, and Trey makes it 14 3. Jumping to the third now, and how about Zach Richards? He's alone with Mitchell Van Every, and Richards stones him cold. Later in the third now, and how about two quick ones on the power play from Colton Marquis? He scores twice in five seconds, and it's 16 3 Northman. Ensuing center draw, and it's the arrows finding some offense. Lewis Alfred buries it on the rush, and the arrows are at four. But it was all Northman tonight, as they'd add three more from Cam Sanderson. Caleb Benedict, and Amos Wickcomb, and the Northmen make it 19 for themselves. And despite a late goal from Tyler Davis, it's a dominant win for the Northmen as they take it over the Six Nations Arrows. This one ending by a final score of 19-5 on Tuesday night.